Welcome to the Infinity College Basketball Tip-Off, bringing you the inspired performances that define the season. And welcome to one of the loudest environments of the SEC, the O'Connell Center here on the campus of the University of Florida in Gainesville. Kentucky is here in a battle of two of the top teams, not only in the SEC East, but in the conference as a whole. And there's Florida, preseason pick to win the league, and there they are in first place at 6-2 and two in the league. The young Wildcats, very competitive, very dangerous. Dangerous four and three in the SEC. Jones and Aaron pass bounces to Liggins. They got to get a shot off, and they do just in time. They've never gotten beyond the first round of the NCAA tournament, and the expectations are high for this program this year. Jones had a good start. Jones to body out. Ty has come up with a rebound. Nice cross court pass. And Harrison will finish. Kentucky off to us. Creates, innovates, penetrates. Only 5'8, but plays a lot bigger than that. Knight. Nice mid range jumper. Kentucky by three. Big time. Isn't it great to hear a kid's got a 4.3 act of very streaky? Miller gets it back. Puts it on the floor and lays it in. And John Calipari will love that. He was telling everyone. Trying to match up in that zone. Lamb could be a real threat against the zone. He's so tonight as he buries one from the corner. Constant change of personnel with the one and done. Jones. Lamb. And he knocks down a three. So Knight and Lamb trying to bust the zone. Well, I think they will. Most talent he can get. Well, he said the Wizard of Westwood, Mr. Wooden. When he speaks, he's the gospel. He said, give me talent over experience. Again, a nice move by Darius Miller. He passed all ranked in the top 20 nationally among incoming freshmen. Knight knocks down another one. This class was great. Last he can shoot the ball. They're going to find him. Nice cut. And Riggins lays it in. A pretty feed from Miller. Yeah, played here two years ago, then a year at junior college, and now with the Cats. Jones, nice basket, and went back to his strong side. He's a lefty, and he just kind of sucked the defender in on that. There he is, one-on-one, -on -one, and he's going to whirl right to the goal. Spins right to the goal, great drop step off the bounce. Watch this now, there's the drop step. There's the drop step, laid on the glass. Multi-talented. Back comes Jones, again, you talked about multi-talented. This is the shot. Vargas finishes. Great rebound right there by Vargas. He's got to feel pretty good. But six, seven sophomore. Sorry, to get to the game and out for Kentucky. A rare eighth different player appearing. Usually John Calipari only plays seven. Nice spin move there. How talented is this? Colson had played a total of 24 minutes the whole season before tonight. Oh, that's the a big shot one. is good for Hood. That's a big one. They get a little more playing time. Oh, he'll be talking about that. So we are at the half as you get one more look at the basket by John Hood. Florida with an arrow two-point lead over Kentucky. Third standing of what it takes to become a quality college basketball player. Nice penetration by Liggins and Harrelson lays it in. What a nice move. Florida dominated for a few years before that. That was during the championship years of 06 and 07. Those teams were special. Miller, yes. Okay, Miller, Harrelson, and Liggins. And Wilbekin all coming in and all playing well. This woman did not get down. Knight oh, shot a big three. Three. one and Knight hits a 25 footer. What a big three. I mean, write the score now. Write it down when that happened. It's unbelievable. Terrence Jones and Brandon. You got to really help out. Got to close off driving lanes. Look at that right there. Unbelievable. You're talking about shooting under pressure. The last foul, by the way, on Kentucky was on Liggins, his third, so we'll keep an eye on that as Brandon Knight is starting to take over. That's a big-time play. Said it a moment ago. He's got to start looking for some. And the rebound numbers now. Lamb, Jones, Lamb, Jones. Great play. Just a terrific play by the two tight for dandies. And I promised I was going to be good. Look at this transition. Draw one. Stay a little bit wider than the lane. The reason you want to do that, it makes it difficult for the guy in the middle to play both. You want a little separation, young people. Just stay a foot on each side of that lane. Kick it. But they were willing to pay that back, make him sit the year and be eligible next year. Yeah, that's what Kentucky was hoping for, but they couldn't get that done. The Cantor ruled permanently ineligible, and he'll be playing pro next year. Knight with a deep three. It's a 9 to nothing run for Kentucky. 
Harrelson and Wiggins on the bench with foul trouble for Kentucky. Brandon Knight, 20 points, four threes. You can give me those three any day of the week. Jones, he'll shoot the three, passes it up here. Wow, that's a tough play. And again, he forces his way back over his right shoulder to his strong side. That was a big time play. Eighth 20 point game of the season. He's knocked down four threes in this game. They've run this play a number of times. Step back. Jones for three again. Most dangerous guy is the guy that sets the screen and steps back from the screen. And that's exactly what Jones did. Knight driving. Good help defense. Open Miller. Got it. Great look by Knight. Miller the veteran makes a big, big shot. Right out of the game. Yeah, he's really had a tough, tough night. So he steps back. And now Again. He duplicated the previous yeah. one. What great timing. That is incredible timing for him to make that play. And again, he's starting from beyond the three-point line. A steal by Walker, a foul a by Nuts have come back as Walker goes to the line. I tell one thing about the catch. You see that uniform? I get like little goosebumps, man. That Mr. Pratt sitting to my right doing the game on radio. Mr. Leach, they do a great job. He wore that uniform. That's right. Our buddy Larry Conley wore that room. Pat Riley, who I went in the Hall of Fame with. Are you kidding me? My wife told me one thing. Don't stand next to Riley when you get in the Hall of Fame. He's too good looking. <laughs> you know what? Tiles right now. Jones down in the post. Florida's been able to win the close games. Yep. Kentucky has had a tough time with that. And there's Walker. Put both of his hands on the defender, and that's going to get called every time. Billy Donovan says, hey, what about the physical stuff of the other? Night. I like it because he's got the whole total package. Classroom, sports, too many guys become one-dimensional. I don't understand responsibilities for later in life. Donovan and Calipari working as hard and pacing as much as their players are tonight. Good free throw shooting by both teams. And Kentucky back on top. Well, he's an excellent free man now. Walker tries to split the defense and gets fouled. It'll be Harrelson, and he's out of the game. John Delaware, he's making a run. Walker on the line for the Gators. One and one. They were charging the guys late in the game. It's a different scenario than shooting early. There's a guy that can shoot right there. Oh, boy. Two big free throws for the junior. Free throw shooter. Walker. Tyus. Jump hook. Yes. Oh, he gets the roll. He's been quiet, but what a big deuce there. We got a one possession game. Timeout, Kentucky. Could this be deja vu again? Come back like they did. They did it to Mississippi, and they come. Boyd doing a great job denying Knight the ball. Now he's finally got it. Jones puts it on the floor, crams it in with a right hand. It's a one point game. Big time shit. He's a matchup nightmare, almost oh, unstoppable. Great fake. What a terrific fake. What a ball fake. He's in the right hand on a jam, left-handed player. But it was the ball fake, Dan, that created that whole opportunity and his first step. Because of the He's going to play it out, Dick. Yep. They're going to go for the stop, hope to get it, and try to score with just a precious few seconds left until Parsons gets the ball. And then Lamb, not called an intentional foul, but intentionally fouled. And he shoots, like I said, that's his one negative. Got to be in his head. He's a 38% three-point shooter. Well, you see the way he squares his body. Great rotation, great release. I think he thinks so much about it. He's reading all the time in the paper about the numbers. If he has a replay of the game, he hears about us talking about it. It's so tough when arguably your best player is a weak free throw shooter. Oh, you want absolutely. him in there at the end of the game. Makes the second. Look pretty good on that one. Now you got Kentucky. If the three is available, you shoot the three. Each team's got a timeout. If it's available, you don't have to get it, obviously, go to overtime with a deuce. But if you got a knife that can shoot that three. 
Puts it up. And Florida wins it. What a big week for Florida basketball. Test one, they get an A, they beat Vanderbilt. Test two, they get an A-plus, they beat Kentucky, who came here a little bit with a chip on their shoulder after losing to Ole Miss on the road. Florida basketball, they'll be dancing in the streets in Gainesville. Brandon Knight, who led all scores with 24 points, missed a three in the dying seconds, and the Florida Gators survived 70-68 to, to go to 7-2 and, and take command in the SEC.